everyone, I'm here playing Pente with Emerson. Pente is a game where you try to get five stones in a row. Uh, the other way to win is to capture five groups of two stones. And so the way you capture stones is if I have two stones next to each other, uh, and you have, and then you put two stones on the outside. So I don't, I don't, in either diagonal or orthogonal ways. Not, but it has to be two, and it has to be, it can't be like three in the middle. Does that make sense? Yeah. Um, I believe the first player will have to place it out, I'll have to place it outside of this red box um, on my next move, I believe. Have to place it outside of the red box? Yes. Just because the first... Oh, no, not you. Sorry. Uh, you might want to take that back. Okay, how do I take it back? Um, if you see the moves on the right-hand side, click the blue arrow on move one so the whole move lights up as blue. I mean, I'll just be able to do it. Yeah, I did it. And then... Yeah. Okay. I think it's your turn, but I'm not entirely sure. Or did it did it revert back or? Ah, uh, the fuck. Oh, is it? It's my turn. Okay. the The way to do it would be to click on the move one where the blue arrow is. Yeah, I did it. And then hit the little revert to this move. Yeah. Did you do that? Yeah, but it did. Yeah. Well, but then when I go to move two, it's still there. Like my move is still yeah. there. Yeah, I'll just I'll just play a bad move too. <laughs> no, I want to fix this. Maybe that doesn't. Yeah, I, I, maybe we can't take it back, and that just shows. I don't know. We'll we'll play more games. <laughs> so five in a row. So things that are our threats, if you get three in a three in a row with some on neither side, it is a threat because that threatens. You have to four. Yeah, and if four in a row on either side, that mean with none on either side, that means you're gonna win. Why? Because. You're going to be able to get to six no matter what. I mean, five no matter what. Yeah, because you'd have to... I'd only be able to block one of the ways. So, do they stack diagonally? Yeah, diagonally, diagonal counts as a five in a row. So that, yeah, it, it has to be two to capture, not three. Yeah, but I still need you to stop you. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So now if I put this if I put one on the other side of that diagonal, it would capture it. I see. Yeah, let's restart. Well, I mean, we can continue going on this game. No, I don't want to because I want to go from where I understand it. <laughs> well what if you win? Did I just give up? I mean, you can give up if you want. No, I'll keep going then, you little bastard. <laughs> I'm gonna lose, dude. I've already lost. I've definitely lost. Like, do you realize like you already have? I no, I mean, I making five and I mean, you need to lose. I'm fucked. Ooh. I know what you should do, dude. <laughs> yeah, duh. Don't be a dumb. <laughs> 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 Is that funny? 
Yeah, it was. I bet we'd make a good, like, I mean, basically this show is our comedy. It's, it's basically our comedy, right? I mean, I mean if you want to really practice. Come to just watch me get destroyed? Like, no, they come for my humor. <laughs> oh, yeah. Funny, right? Okay, new game. Okay. Okay, dude. Like, that was bullshit. I didn't understand. <laughs> You've already played this game. I haven't. I played it once. With... Yes. It's not fair then. That doesn't count because now I've only played it once. And now we're on the. Now, but see, you're always going to be ahead of me a little bit. So it never matters <laughs> if I. Do... But I did. When I did play it once against Mike, I lost every single game we played. So you're making me feel a little bit better that I'm not completely worthless in this game. Is Mike pretty chill? Yeah, he's good. He's cool. Should hang with Mike sometime. Have we not played three play? You played. I think you only played three player chess with me and Matt. I don't know if. So I have to place this one outside of the square. I believe so. If I mean, if not, you can try placing it inside, and it, it'll just tell you if, if you have to. Did it tell you you had to? Yeah. <laughs> so I believe, I'm not 100% on this, but if I went in the middle of those, I don't think I'd, I would be captured. I think it's just once you place a stone. I don't I have any reason to do that, but uh, I think that's the case. Okay, okay. I've never won, well, I've never won a we, what? None of the games we played were won by captures. Oh damn it! Can I take that back? Uh, well, I mean, you can, <laughs> you can you can try. I don't know. I mean, we try to take back the other ones. God damn it! Just forget it. <laughs> Fucking. I can put one over here. I can. No, I've already lost, dude. I wanted to take those two. I was trying to take <laughs> those two. You did already lose. Six, two and six, man. <laughs> Are you thinking hard on yours? Yeah, I mean, I don't have, I don't have five in a row, so I don't know. Yeah. So why was it so awkward with that girl? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I I feel like it's more me than anything. I I. Have you played Go before? Like, do you know how to play Go? Yeah. Uh, no, not really. I've tried once to learn, but I didn't care enough. <laughs> <laughs> That's honestly why. I've enjoyed it. Yeah. 
I mean, I do like I. There is versions of Go that have different types of Go pieces, and that's what I yeah. like. I like about chess of different types of pieces working together. They but, have different types of Go pieces. Well, I mean, not not standard stuff, but like in yeah, variants. Yeah, they have other types of Go. Yeah, there's a bunch of Go variants. It's your you know mood. about Francis Bacon's painting? No. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Does it annoy you when I bring up like obscure references like that? <laughs> no, it's good. But it's uh, it is your move. I don't know. If you, it, there's a clock on this one, so I don't know if you're oh, watching. Oh shit! <laughs> it's pretty. Was, we we have quite a lot of time though, so. I was chilling on a site over here. <laughs> oh, damn it. I was like looking at I don't even know what I was looking at. I was looking at a Francis Bacon painting. <laughs> Francis Bacon is quite an interesting painter, dude. Check him out, man. Have you checked out his shit? Can't say I have. Quite good. These stones are just slightly offset. I think it's because of my browser, but it's most likely my browser. Likely your browser. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, that was funny, wasn't it? Yes, indeed. <laughs> that was indeed funny. So what kind of jokes would y'all come up with? We didn't really come up with things together. I mean, it was more just like trying to work out like ideas of bits and like, cause I think most Owen Mike stuff was just like, you got five minutes, 10 minutes at most. So like the ones we saw, saw was like some, you know, told a story or I don't know. So like, there's nothing I was really, you know, I was dead set on doing, and I was about to, you know, go up and do it. Um, yeah, I was, I was kind of more like thinking of, do I, you know, am I the comedian or am I gonna create a character that is a funny character, a character in some way? Right. What's one of your best characters you've come up with? <laughs> uh, I mean, I wouldn't call... I would, no, I mean... It's... I wouldn't call them characters even. I was just like, how I... You know, what's my persona? Like, do I... You know, I, I'm not... I'm, if I'm not 100% myself, whatever that is. You know. Um, I think a great character would just be... Somebody who's, who's in love with cheese, cheese puff. And Man, you like are their whole bit just <laughs> around the idea of cheese puffs. So like, it'll always somehow be related. Like, it could be side, like getting money, like my job. But then it always, in the end, comes back to like, yeah, so I can buy my cheese puff. You know what I mean? <laughs> so his whole life just surrounds cheese puff. But it's like in a way where it's like you can still he still lives in the world. But, like, all of his desires at the very end of, like, what is life, the core is cheap buffs. So it's like, <laughs> you know, it's like a joke that can come in at any time, right? But it also allows you to be the kind of comedian you want to be. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you can write jokes that are for anyone. But then you always have that little hook of, like, yeah, I could just make it about cheese buffs. And then, it, like, I don't know, it's just, I think that's an interesting little part, which allows, like, a good comedian to shine, but also lets them stick out a little bit. The cheese comedian. 
that a good character? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, definitely Sasha Baron Cohen with characters has been like killing it. What did he do with characters? Like he's been killing it with characters recently. It's yeah, it's still your t- it's your turn. I don't know if you're like. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I, I don't feel like you think I'm that, that funny right now. His, my character's I'm, I'm saying doing well. <laughs> Sasha Baron Cohen's character, like all of his characters. My, yeah, my character's not doing well. What did you say? All so of his... Who's Sasha Bowen? Yeah, he has Borat. Who else does he have? He has, who's the gay one? Bruno. Bruno, he has Bruno. Who else does he have? Uh, I don't know the names of all of them. But you know Bruno and that one, right? Yeah. What is he like in real life? I don't know. I mean, <laughs> I've seen a few interviews of him and as normal, but I mean, you know, he just seems. I think I lost. Oh, okay. I was thinking you could have captured two of the stones in the middle. Oh, yeah. Can I take that back? If you can. Oh. <laughs> I can't. Okay. Damn it. So I could have gotten out of that one. But then I think I, I could have actually... gone... I think I could have still gotten it. I'm not entirely sure. No, you could have because then if you put the black one back, right? Yeah, I put the black one back. Right? Yeah, that's what my plan... Oh, no, because I had to block your five. Your four, that's... If you captured those two, I'd have to re-block that five in a row. Oh, right. That's so good, isn't it? It's such a deep game. My mouse isn't hovering over where, I need, where it needs to hover over. That's, that's a very deep game, man. I don't know, man. I've just been really getting into film recently. Like, have you ever heard of Lars von Trier? <laughs> no, I haven't. Yeah. <laughs> have you? No. Oh, I thought you had, and that's why you were laughing. You were laughing because you hadn't? Yeah, because it's like the third or so one you brought up, and I've been like, nope. Never. Never heard of him. Lars von Trier, dude. <sighs> this stuff, man. He does this one call this one um, movie called Nymphomaniac. <laughs> <laughs> and it's it's just what it sounds like. Like it is just a woman who is absolutely obsessed with sex. And then it just just shows you her life like fall the fuck apart because of her addiction to sex. <laughs> it just like it goes and it just shows like everything. And then you just realize and so here's the whole time. So when you first meet her character, listen to how good a story this is. So when you first meet her character, you, um, when you first, see, I did my move, so don't get mad. Um, when you first meet her character, she's, like, in this shitty-ass, like, oh, actually, you see her get beat up. She's beat up in the road, and she falls down, and it's raining, and this guy comes up to her, Stellan Skarsgård or whatever his name is um he's common in his films um he she meets her and he's like are you okay do you need help and then like he goes back to her place to like give her some comfort or whatever or like he actually wait he invites her to his place and he like gives her a place to stay and like a place to rest and then like he starts you know asking her about her life and then she starts like opening up about like yeah i'm like a sex addict this is my life and like you know it's building into like why she got her face fucking beat in but like as the whole thing like unravels like you realize and he like unveils his like philosophy of like just life and like women and all this stuff and then at the very end like he's like her only friend you know like he's like well, you think he's her friend, right? And then, like, at the very end, he just, like, tries to rape her. And it's like, holy shit, dude. It's like, wow. 
like it just kind of flipped everything you were thinking about the world right it's like you think he's this nice guy and she even mentions about that like and she mentions how i don't know like all of her relationships with men and stuff and then suddenly bam you know It's like, oh shit, he's the asshole. <laughs> no, no, it was a good movie, man. How's your sister doing? She's fine. Um, I'm gonna talk to her. Today, I guess, for a little bit. What is she doing? She just has the weekend off. Her husband's, like, gone for the weekend. As like, a... I think it's a hunting trip. I think he's fishing or hunting or... Or just, like, a cabin trip, maybe. I don't... Something like that. With his friends? I think with his dad, if I'm not mistaken. It's yeah. nice. But she has the kid to herself currently. So I'm sure that's... Well, I don't know. I mean, I think... Would that feel like a lot to you? I think any any time being a parent is just... Gonna be super stressful. Dude, like... Yeah, doesn't that make you think, like, how the fuck am... Yeah, I just do not see myself having kids. Right now. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, yeah, that one's pretty clear. Because <laughs> it's coming up on, like, the age where I'm going to be my sister's age when she has had the kid. Right. So... It's weird to uh, weird to think about. Yeah, man, my philosophy is just I'm getting a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's just like, yeah, fuck it, dude. I'm here. I have to do this shit. I'm like, I like it, but it's also just like, dude, this is my excuse to not have to worry about that bullshit. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. What are you doing, dude? <laughs> just, just like it. <laughs> Jesus, man. Just fucking with you. I play to win. <laughs> I also play to lose. What? What happened? Just oh, well, you took those stones. Yeah, you didn't see that? No, I didn't see that when I first did it. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> You've killed me pretty much every day. Master plan. I'm not used to those capture rules. So yeah, I really didn't see that, that the first time. I'm just not used to those capture rules. I don't want to get any more stones taken. Darn it, I just lost. <laughs> No. 
Oh, yeah, because I can, yeah, I wouldn't have thought. So I think we both have one, ca yeah, one capture each. Never won by capture, but I'm going to go for some captures. I'm going to capture you. Just <laughs> 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 That's a great joke. Come on, man. Go you sure got me on that one. <laughs> that's such a creepy joke. Like, that's a joke you use. Yeah. Like, yeah, that's such a great one, man. Fuck. Yeah. Comedians are great because, like, they show you the concept of language, you know? Like, they unveil the concepts <laughs> within them. Like, it, they really do, man. I mean, they're masters of language. Like, they are masters of connotation. You know? Masters. Fucking incredible. They are, dude. That's why, if you're funny, you'd probably be a good writer. <laughs> okay, so... Um, it's your turn. So where do I have this capture at? <laughs> <laughs> trying, to <find> it. <laughs> trying to find this little fucking capture. Oh my capture, she's so good. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't work out. I just had it too. You know, doesn't quite work out yet. I feel like you were just pulling my leg. <laughs> is there really a capture do you promise oh no I don't. you can't capture no I didn't say there was a capture I said I'm going to capture you no I thought you said we each have a capture right now I, I don't think I said that I don't think I said that <laughs> really I don't remember saying that okay fuck I'm fucked then you had a capture before my last move that I missed or yeah yeah. I played at K10, and if you would have went there, it would have been a capture. Should just say the name of the stone. <laughs> the name of the stone? Yeah, the... the the number of the stone. Which stone did you place? 24, K10. Oh, B10. K K10. Oh, K10. K as in Kit Kat. Oh, K, yeah, I see. I see it now. How awesome. <laughs> Oh. What? Didn't you just win? No. Didn't you just put four in a row with neither on either side? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Did I? Diagonally, to four, oh. yeah. See, the diagonal ones, because of your fucking browser, <laughs> are harder to see. Well, it should be your browser, too. If you're looking at it's, <laughs> it's not, you're not looking at my browser. I just won, biatch. You gonna do one more of these? Yeah, let's do it, dude. Are you surprised that I could actually win one? No, I'm not, I, I have faith in you, Emerson. You have faith in me? Of course. Yeah, it's interesting. Yeah, they're really far outside of that line. What'd you say? They're really far outside of that line. Like mine's on the, <laughs> like that I one know, right there. Dude. 
What if I was lying to you the whole time and like the reason I won that last one is because my browser is actually not fucked up and like I just heard <laughs> saying that yours was fucked up and then I started commenting like that to make you think that I've had my board like that. Do you believe that was the case? No. You think my board is probably just as messed up as yours if you had to take a guess? No! No! <laughs> <laughs> what happened? I went in the wrong square. <laughs> <laughs> you little dumbo. <laughs> oh yeah, because you could have cast it. <laughs> what an easy capture. <laughs> I know. <laughs> well, <laughs> you should have gotten that one, dude. It would have been, yeah. That would have been an easy life for you. How about that? How about that up your big fat rap? <laughs> <laughs> How about that? Don't keep track. Biddy biddly bat. Bat. Oh, shitty snap. Yeah, that's what I was saying. How about that? How about that? That's a wrap. I'm going to lose. Oh, snap. You thinking? <laughs> I'm thunking. We got nine minutes on my clock. Don't rush me. Boom, 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 <laughs> cap. Boom, boom, boom. So what's been what's been a stressful moment getting your doctorate? Because it's if it's if it's been stressful. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Really, dude, the schoolwork's not bad at all easy okay once I get my mindset right dude <laughs> it's gonna be game over man <laughs> yeah. I've had so much time once like, I, I battle so depression and get my work my straight work. I'll be on so uh, it, it reminds me of a okay it, it reminds me of like a, a meat I guess not a meme I don't know but it's like as long as I eat healthy start exercising regularly battle depression I'll be un <laughs> you know, like a few other things. It's like I'll be unstoppable. Yeah, but I didn't say all that. I just said my mindset. Yeah. yeah. Like because I mean, most of the time I've just been in my own head thinking I can't do it. You know, that's my problem. It, because the work itself. I just handed in a paper or an abstract for the paper I'm writing. Okay. And the dude, like, says, first he, like, asked me about okay, because, like, I've been kind of depressed and down. And then after that, he's like, because he's like, Emerson, it's fine. Like, you shouldn't have skipped class that day to do this. Like, I don't care. But he's like, he did turn it in. He's like, dude, this is a great, great <laughs> opening for a paper. Like, you really have something going here. And he was like, dude, I mean, you got it. You know what's going on. <laughs> It like looks fuck, man. It looks like the more we go to the left side of the board, the more it lines up with the line. Interesting. Yeah, so I'm not worried, man, you know? Like, if I've been this, like, been screwing up in my own head this much and I can write abstracts that are 
good without even having done most of my work. It's like, like been not in the right place. It's like, damn, dude. So you can make yourself be in between two stones. Yes. That you have to well. make the move of putting that stone there, and then it captures. Right. Caption number, game? caption number four. should have a win here somewhere. I think you should have a win yourself by now. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> Did you just fuck up? No, it's just uh, I'll have to respond to your to your blocking of my five. No! Okay, why? Well, yeah, I did mess up there. Okay. <laughs> you fucked up. You but totally no, because I just captured five. Look at that. First time with a win of capturing. I'm done. You're done? I so said that was the first time of cap w winning with a capture. That's cool, man. But I am, I guess I would say I'm done as well. You don't want to play anymore? It's it's midnight. Like, okay. Uh, if it's so, I'll stay on the I can stay on the line for a little bit. Right. Yeah. Thanks for watching, Pente, everyone. Hope to see in more videos. See you next time. Oh crap! I didn't realize we were still online.